All right, we're on to example two now. And I've, I've just realized I haven't mentioned something, so I'm going to mention it now. And that is what the word, what this little PA part here. Um, P dot A dot just means per annum, if you didn't know. And per annum is just another way of saying per year. Okay, so this is a, an interest rate of 6% per year. Right. Joan has a loan of 20 grand and pays a 6% per annum flat rate of interest, meaning simple interest. Question A, how much interest will he pay after 20 months? And whenever you get a question and they give you something in months, notice, I mean, last question we had some months, but we were able to convert it to 3.5 years. This one we is a little tricky to convert to years. We're going to keep it as months, but uh, we'll, we'll get to there in a second. Let's just look at each pronumeral. Uh, Principal is 20 grand. Our rate of interest is 6% per annum. Okay, now this is a bit of a problem because our time periods is 20, 20 months. I'll write that down. N equals 20 months. And the problem we're facing is that the 6% is in years and the N is in months. Now one of them has to change. You either make them both years or you make them both months. Now most of the time it's easier to make your interest rate into months if you, to change that one. So what we're going to do, because there's 12 months in a year, we're going to do 6% divided by 12 which gives us 0.5%. So if we're charged 6% per year, it means we're charged 0.5% per month. Okay, once again, you have to take your percentage and you have to divide it by 100. So we're actually going to get 0.005 for R. Now let's calculate our interest using the formula PRN or P times R times N, which is 20 grand times R.005 times N, uh, which is 20 months. Let's see what we get. 20 grand times 0.05, sorry, 0.005 times 20 gives me $2,000. Excellent. So my interest is two grand. Question B says what monthly repayments will he need to pay if he hopes to pay off his loan in 20 months? All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go, all right, well, he's gonna to have to pay back the 20 grand. If he wants to pay off his loan, he has to pay off the amount he borrowed. And he also has to pay off the interest, which after 20 months will be two grand. So he's gotta pay off um, 22,000, sorry, um, yeah, Joe has to pay off $22,000 over a period of 20 months. How are we going to work that out? Well, if we just go 22,000 divide 20, it'll find out how much he needs to pay each month, which comes out to $1,100. So if he pays $1,100 each month, after 20 months, he should pay off his loan and finish it. 